is an intuitive young man who is very hardworking. He is dedicated. He is the perfect person to listen to what others want and to be their spokesperson. You know, Garrett, I've known him for, you know, three years now. Uh, plays football for me. He's been doing an outstanding job. He's a very hard worker and he's also that in his classroom too. Uh, he's a very smart kid. You know, I really hope that you guys will take a chance and vote for him so that next year when he's my water boy, he won't take it so bad. He's a very bright young man, very understanding of complex materials, but really the biggest advocate I have for him being uh, this youth gov from youth and government is the fact that I've taken three photos with Garrett over my lifetime. And I've never looked better in a photo than when I'm standing right next to him. Garrett Thorne, not your typical politician. He's honest, he admits when he's wrong, plus he's a heck of a middle linebacker. Vote for Garrett! For a strong and hardworking leader, vote Thorne for governor. Hi, my name is Julia Wong, and I'm running to be your youth governor of Michigan Youth and Government. I'm from the Cranbrook Kings of Delegation, and I currently live in Franklin, Michigan. I've lived in Southeast Michigan for the past 17 years of my life, and I especially love our beautiful state because of all our amazing nature, as well as eating delicious Mackinac Fudge whenever my family and I go up north. I believe I am fit to be your youth governor because of my experience in working with politics in the real world, not to mention my responsibility and leadership skills. Over the summer, I did an internship with District State Representative Tor Padma Koopa of Troy and Clawson, and through this internship, I both participated in and helped lead phone banks, text banks, and community events. Through this opportunity, I've talked to both community leaders as well as hundreds of regular voters, and it's through these experiences that I believe myself to be the best possible candidate. With all that being said, I hope you all will consider voting Julia Wong to be your youth governor. Thank you. Hi, my name is Emma Macaluso, and I'm running to be your youth governor in 2022. Emma is a perfect candidate for youth governor because she has amazing collaboration and communication skills, which allow her to work well with others. I take pride in my ability to work with others, despite different political views. No matter the issue, I believe I can effectively come to a solution that helps the state of Michigan. Emma comes from a delegation that participates in legislature, NIF, and MJP. She has experience with each one and knows how important unity within the conference is to all delegates. I want to continue working with the staff and schedules to integrate the program areas into one united conference that we all feel a part of. Finally, Emma's goal is to create an inclusive and accepting environment that encourages civil debate and impactful solutions to the issues debated by the youth of our state. I'm Emma Macaluso, and I approve this message. My name is Mackenzie. I'm running for youth governor. There's a lot of issues, but not a lot of time, so let's get going. A lot of delegates feel like their voices aren't heard, and I get it. That's why I want to implement a system that allows delegates to tell the program runners what they want. It can even be an anonymous submission. You want to get rid of family groups? I'll get on it. This year, conference has to be virtual. But when we're in person, there's a lot of schedule changes. That makes people, especially first timers, more prone to getting lost. As your governor, I promise I'll work hard and make the first schedule the only schedule. Do you know that there's a possibility for a bill to be passed in the Michigan House that would increase the school year by 20 days? That's ridiculous. These kinds of laws come from senators and representatives who are completely out of touch with our school system. As governor, my focus will be on passing bills that decrease the stress of the school year while making sure we're just as prepared for our future, if not more. Here's where you come in. If you vote for me for governor, I promise to work hard and make this all possible. Because in 2022, Mackenzie is for you!